Hey guys, it's Hannah, and today I am back with a long-awaited book collection update. And before we get started, I want you to know that I am in a different filming location because I am at my mom's house. Yes, you can tell by the fuzzy blanket I am here in a different place, living with my mom for a little while before I end up going back to school in the spring. So. Let's go ahead and review these four new books, plus a couple of things that I've also added on to the collection. And yeah, so let's get started. First book that I have is called The Search Party by Hannah Richell, or Richell. A Weekend to Die For. Yep. I got this book because name's Hannah, but also it seems like a really interesting book and I'm really excited to see what it's going to be about. It's about this family that goes on this trip. They learn about some things about each other, but then a storm breaks out and they're left stranded and they find out some stuff and uh, while trying to figure out a way to get back home. So yeah, the search party. Next up is Skeleton Crew by Stephen King. This is a collection of stories. One of his first stories, or maybe his first uh, short story collection or something like that. I don't know. But I am really, really excited to finally have this collection. This is probably one that I've had my eyes on for a while. Um, I'm not going to go into detail about what's in here, but I do know that one of the stories that's in here is called... Uh, uh, word processor of the gods, which I have watched the Dark Tales of the Dark Side episode for that. The jaunt, which I've heard is pretty interesting. The raft, and uh, survivor type. But I'm really excited to read it, and I will do a video where I review every single story and let you guys know what I think. So, yeah, skeleton crew. Next up is Malice by Heather Walter the first book in the Malice series. This is a Sleeping Beauty retelling. And it's basically about, it's kind of like Maleficent, if you will, where the, uh, the wicked witch is trying to redeem herself by undoing the curse on Princess Aurora. Really excited to see how it's gonna play out. Yep, Malice. And then the last book in the in the update is The Murder House by James Patterson and David Ellis. This house will cost you your life. This is my first James Patterson book I've ever gotten. This is about a house that has it's notorious for being the murder house because of unsolved murders that have taken place. And this detective goes in after a murder happens to try to figure out what happens and to stop the killer. So I'm really excited to read this one. I, I feel like I really will like this one a lot. So anyway, got the books out of the way. Let's go ahead and look at some of my update stuff. I got this planner. It's called She Believed She Could, So She Fucking Did. <laughs> it's pretty funny. My mom got this for me. She said, you'll never find one like this, so I decided to get it. It'll be my 2025 planner. And then I got a new Bible cover for a new Bible that I just got recently. He works all things for the good of those who love him, quoted directly from Romans 8.28. So that is my update, and I'm really excited to review these books, read them, let you guys know what I think. I am very happy with this collection. And I'm super excited to figure out what else is going to be in my channel. I sound a little off, but that's okay. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, if there's any book that you would like me to review or read or whatever, let me know. Make sure to subscribe for more videos like this. And I will see you guys next time.